Um, this guy said, hey, guys, getting right to it. I've been seeing this girl for four months now. We really haven't done a lot sexually, but last night was going to be the night. Mm-hmm. She comes to my place. Things started getting hot and heavy. But then I started to smell something. Oh, God. Something I've Jeez. never smelled with her before. <sighs> and since she was wearing a dress, I could tell instantly where it was coming from. This is terrible news. After the smell became more consistent, I stopped the action and kind of wrapped up the night. I then, to be sure, smelled where yeah, she was sitting. Yeah, got it. And I just about puked, guys. It smelled like death. <laughs> What are your thoughts? I really like her. I'm desperate. No. Do I say something to her? Do I take this to the grave so I don't hurt her feelings? Well, oh don't God. say anything to her. It smelled what like something say? died or was you smell? decaying. You smell. <laughs> you Your smelled in. up my furniture. No, you can't say that. Your bottom parts stink. Stink. You smelled up my furniture. That's like <laughs> devastating. Can you right. imagine? Even as a guy, someone say saying that. that to I'll you. I'll be honest, like, though. What do, what do I do what? if you smell up my furniture? That's pretty I, bad. Like, that's like, you can't, there's no kind That's medical, like, there's no fixing right? that. That's I don't know. That's, that's, that's not, not right. It seems like she'd know about it, too. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, you think. I mean, she's got to be aware of it. Or Is it her like butt? A, God, please, <laughs> please. I don't want to think about that either. I don't want to think. I do not. Okay, Someone the thing said, is, there's no coming back from you smelled up my furniture. No, there isn't. There no, isn't. Like, no. that's it. That's like, it. You're it's done. over. You're it's done. done. So he's four months invested, and even though he still that's wants to get with her months. sexually. Four months is nothing. That's a lot. Would not get laid. Oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> it's a long time. Well, try it again. <laughs> See if she still stinks. Uh, See and if, if it was just a one-off. Yeah, like, I, I think that's what I would do. Uh, yeah. That's all you can do. So you just get another gander at it. But you can't tell her how to be hygienic. Right. And live life. Yeah. If she and do you want a that. relationship like that where you gotta <laughs> be like, hey, wash your vagina? <laughs> Listen. I'm trying to love you. <laughs> yeah. Just wash your bits. I I have to be the gross one. Like that's how I'm looking at life. Like, no, I, I, I should be the gross be, one. But I listen. No, I can't be the gross one the either. Time. I'm not for that. No but, men should be gross. No, I, no. I totally no women agree. But if one person has to be grosser no. than the other, get it all together. Everyone get it together. Dudes should men, be you naturally get it more gross than ladies. Exactly. Yeah, but you should no. But get it together. Figure out your bits. Because that's going to be one of the first that's things. That's going to be the out. argument right at the end. Be, figure out your vagina! <laughs> <laughs> I can't do it anymore. And you slam the door closed. <laughs> figure out your vagina smell! Closed. How would I not have discovered this before this? That there was a smell from that area. Yeah. In doing other so things. So it was just a one time thing, but death? I mean, that's a strong Death is yeah. a real bad. That's not I, just. A little smell, or whatever, bacteri- bad day. Like, but mm, death? bacterial vaginitis keeps coming up too, and that needs like medication. That's well, something she should go see a doctor, a doctor about. But if she doesn't, she, she mustn't but, realize, you guys. How can you not realize if you smell but like you death? But you can't. You Would you go willingly to have sex with someone? No. If you knew you smelt like death and decaying? But how no. can she not smell it herself? She she can. Uh, Trisha's in Sterling Heights. Hi, Trisha. Hi, how are you? Good, thanks. Yeah, a girl knows when they stink. Come on now. I don't care. This lady, this woman is either lazy and don't want to take a shower, or the guy needs to definitely tell her and embarrass her, and that way she will take a shower. Because trust me, she knows. A girl knows when they stink. So, it's disgusting. Well, then what? <laughs> if she knows <laughs> she stinks, why is no, it? You guys, no, we, we get it. Stop, I don't know we anything about women. Yeah, I know. But you just, no, like, we, need to, we need to stop beating around the bush. A girl knows when she stinks. Come on now. <laughs> That's disgusting. And, and, yeah, all girls know when they stink. They get a whiff of it. Don't tell me they don't. <laughs> okay. I don't know. <laughs> what? I mean, yeah, Dave. I'm okay. I'm, yeah, I'm Dave. Get anything. with it. She's just being a slut this morning. Know, yeah. yeah. She's just oh, get with it. Yeah. <laughs> yes, he needs to call her out on it, and that way she'll be embarrassed about it, and it'll hopefully never happen okay, again. Okay, Trisha, if right. you were him, what exactly yeah. would you say to her? Give me how you'd approach it. Um, I would say, um, uh, you stink. You gotta <laughs> take a shower. Yeah, yeah. You have to. That's what I thought. <laughs> 
Yeah, no, no beating around the bush. <laughs> no, not at all. Not, you don't lay it on no. nice. You're like, man, no. you stunk up my couch. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah. All right, Trisha. You have to. All the best. She knows she stinks. You know you stink. You know you stink. You stink. You ruined my couch. Yeah. Yeah, let's not forget that part of it. Yes. Yeah. Thanks, Trisha. Thanks, Trisha. <laughs> Bye. Yeah, the like guy had to buy a new couch. Let's not forget that part of it. This isn't just like a minor smell. She ruined his couch. Yeah. yeah. He can still smell her on the couch. <laughs> I mean, that's not that's normal. That's bad. That's really bad. Um, Colette, this is where you were sitting. What's your take on this? Hey, you know, she could just be like at the end of her period. I know that when I had periods, my last few days, I really smelled terrible. Yeah, I bet. You know, and if he just gave her a week or so to get over it. That's what I think. He's got to he's got to attack this thing on a different day. Right. Try give her a week and try it again. And if and if. And maybe they can they can do it. They can have some sex. And yeah, then, then maybe loosen can it up. It to her that you know, last time you know there was a smell, <laughs> and she'll probably say, "Yeah, I know, I smelled bad those last few days," <laughs> and they'll talk about it. They need to talk about it, but he needs I to agree. have success first. You know. Yeah, exactly. So you, the yeah. best time to talk about it is post a sexual experience that went just fine. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah just give her I a agree. week to try it again. One week, yeah. one whole week. Mm-hmm. Call yeah. it, like, so one you call week, it. Yeah. You need like a week around that time just Pat, to used to clear it out. You need a week to let it all clear out. Yeah, <laughs> right. Uh, yeah, I don't. Yeah. I don't. Cause, yeah, cause, cause, I don't right. disagree. And get real old stinky yeah. down there. We're a little sticky down there, yeah, especially at the end of it. Yeah. It, it was, as I got older, it got smellier. You know? Oh, wow. Oh, God. Wow. And then it went away. Oh, yeah. I don't know how old this woman is. I don't know if she's, like, uh, in her late 30s, and she'd be a little smellier than she was in her 20s. Oh, that's right. true, yeah. Can, call that, what, that yeah. what age of life are you in now, if you don't mind me asking? I'm 63. 63. Okay. I said yeah. goodbye to periods some time ago, and I'm quite pleased. Yeah, get rid of them, huh? Wave goodbye to them. Yeah. Yeah. Bye-bye, periods. I mean, they, they seem terrible. You. They seem terrible. Glad uh, to know you're dried up. <laughs> Thanks for calling in. You're, you're welcome. Take care. See you. See you. That's old dry Colette. <laughs> Colette's really um, comfortable with it. Discussing it. I love taking the calls from the women. <laughs> she seemed like the, the Norm McDonald. She was the Norm <laughs> McDonald, like a female <laughs> Norm McDonald. She's like, I used to stink down there. <laughs> Big whoops, how do you think? I really smell it. <laughs> Call it at a different delivery. Yeah, she did. <laughs> Does she sound like Mama Fratelli from the Goonies. <laughs> it's more like. Yeah, that would have been more raspy. Yeah, yeah like but my vagina. vagina. <laughs> Female Norm MacDonald. Yeah. Oh. Yep.